for us, our volunteers are how we can make all of this possible. And I'd like to take this opportunity to give a heartfelt thank you to Rachel and Emily for the invaluable contribution to the ambassador committee and program and for their efforts in making the Go STEM program even better than what it was before. We have been, a, um, both of you have been a true example of what getting it done looks like. And for not being afraid to pivot even when the rest of the world thought it was hard. We're very sad that you cannot continue with us moving forward. However, I know that you will both continue to inspire and support more women in the workforce moving forward. I believe in both of you. Bella, I wanna thank you for your continued contribution to the board for the last four years, including the two years served as the chair of the board. Your efforts in helping the board move forward uh, from a working board to a governing board have not gone unnoticed. You worked so hard with Nikhil from Adaptive Aid to ensure we nail down our OKRs to help us trace our progress. And this is something that we'll continue to do at board meetings and because of your support, we will be including that in the committee as well. Thank you for leading the governance committee and working with me and all board members and the board matrix, um, on the board matrix, sorry, to continue to make her evolution more diverse and inclusive, starting with our team. Now, at her evolution, and I hope I'm not gonna cry, as you all know, I'm a crier, so I'm hoping I'm not gonna cry, but, um, Volunteers, oh. okay, sorry. Okay, you I'm can okay. do I'm this. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, yes, yes, yes. Oh God, why am I getting only so emotional? Oh, okay, so I have uh, evolution. Volunteers are the heart of what we do. And it would be impossible to break barriers and make any impact without the support of volunteers. While we appreciate everyone's efforts, I want to take this opportunity to recognize the volunteers who go above and beyond their duties to ensure we achieve our goals. And we're going to start with Cindy Chen. So I wanna thank you on behalf of Bella who nominated you for this recognition. You have been a member of the governance committee since joining her evolution. And over the past year, the committee has made great progress in completing some of the objectives the group has set out to do. And Cindy was a key contributor to two initiatives, um, interviewing youth committees members on their interest in being included in succession planning and documenting research on different benefits providers for individuals. Her work provided the committee with meaningful and actionable information. We were able to move forward with realizing one of our accomplishments and that implemented staff benefit to ensure we can attract and retain the resources we need. And we have great information to support our approach to succession planning for some of our members. And aside from the above, Cindy maintains a high level of engagement with the committee by willingly offering her time to help out with any work that needs to be done and willingly offers her feedback, comments and all on all governance matters. Who, Julia, Julia Silvia, Silva. Not only our MC today, Julia is a seminar program alumni and she has been involved in the fundraising committee working with Kate to help develop a fundraising plan for her evolution in 2020, 2022. Kate cannot express her gratitude enough for the work you have done with us. And here's what she had to say. While in the fundraising committee, Julia has demonstrated a keen and passionate interest in learning the art of sales. In her life, she's a representative of her evolution's mission, doing her part to spread the word of STEM to other young women. She's a perfect example of why we exist. Thank you. Rachel Young. Rachel has worked with us for, uh, for less than a year and however, she made great contribution to the volunteering committee. I have personally heard Ashima express gratitude for Rachel's work and she mentioned a couple of times about what a difference it makes when working with the right people in a team. Here's what Ashima had to say about Rachel. Rachel, 
uh, exemplifies qualities that we value in our volunteers, namely taking initiative, being proactive, and making thoughtful suggestions to implement better tools and processes. I am beyond excited to share this recognition for you all, and I am grateful for your contribution to our committee and that you decided to share your time and talents with our organization. Oh my goodness. And since we're celebrating our 10th year anniversary, I thought it would be great if we highlight some of our unicorns that have left their mark when it comes to breaking barriers at her evolution. And I hope I'm not going to cry. Seriously. Um, Saba. Saba Zafar. So I wanted to celebrate you as a young trailbla trailblazer that you are. You started volunteer at her evolution almost seven years ago. Yes. We have volunteers with us for seven years. So yes, you started volunteering at Revolution almost seven years ago. You simply reached out and asked to get involved. At first, I had no idea how to go about it and what kind of work to give you because we did not have many volunteers involved, but then you were willing to do anything to help. I told you I need support with, for the program we were running at that time. And you went on and found speakers and resources to support the participants. You did that effortlessly and effortlessly, and we're still looking for more to contribute. That's when I saw something in you and we got together to see what else we could do. You voiced your opinion to have more young women included, and that's how the youth committee started. And because of your willingness to create change, we now have young women represented at the board by not only getting their board training, but ultimately because uh, becoming a voting member of the board. You amplify the voices of so many young women who now have the confidence to lead teams in, of their own at her evolution and otherwise. I am say, so grateful to you for making that happen. Thank you, Saba. And J Jada Chang, I am celebrating you as an, an emerging leader that you are, even when you do not see it yourself. You started our revolution as a stamina program participant in 2019. The following year in 2020, you became an ambassador for revolution and you changed the game for all of us. You took on the leadership role and fundraise for revolution, then gave um, extra exposure to revolution by including us in an article where you shared your experience here. You developed the tech curriculum for the Go STEM program and work with our partners to ensure they're equipped to teach our program participants. Because of your work here, we're able to have our Go STEM program run independently with the support of the ambassadors. You led this initiative and showed us that it can be done. If that wasn't enough, you signed up for the Stemming Up Committee as well in 2021, and I decided to extend an invitation for you to coordinate the Stemming Up program that summer. Once again, you show me that you are a true leader and you raise the bar for what commitment to a cause looks like. I have been so impressed with you and I'm so happy that you were able to, we were able to hire you to work with us in 2022, not as a coordinator, but as a curriculum designer for the Stemming Up program. I knew you would do it because you are one of the most resourceful young leaders I know. You figured out and showed others how to do it as well. And you manage your time to not only volunteer and work at Revolution, but you give your time to other causes as well. I really do not know how you do it, but you are simply an amazing and true leader that I hope uh, will inspire many others that will meet you. And now,